three commissioners in just one term. That's what's happening in Bear County Precinct 3. Grant Moody was sworn into that seat this morning and now represents the northern part of Bear County on commissioner's court. Garrett Berger was at the ceremony this morning. Garrett, his term is only about half of a normal commissioner's. Is that correct? That's absolutely right. It's only the seat is actually going to be up for election again in 2024. These are normally four year terms. Now, the reason why is because Moody's not doing a full term. He's finishing out the term that Trish DeBerry had to give up so she could make her run for county judge. With today's swearing in ceremony, Moody will replace Maria Lynn Barnard, who was temporarily appointed to replace DeBerry. And he will be the one taking the seat for precinct three. So who is Grant Moody? He's a former Marine F-18 pilot who served in both Iraq and Afghanistan. He's off active duty now, but still in the reserves. He's also been an exec at USAA and most recently Valero Energy, which he says he will leave next week so he can take this office and give it its full attention. Now, the new commissioner will be the only Republican on commissioner's court. He says his biggest priority, public safety, bringing up jail staffing issues as an example, which was also a priority of DeBerry's. And I know that this has been an issue that, that we've been working on, uh, the court's been working on, my colleagues have been working on for, for uh, quite some time. But how can we can, can, uh, get ahead of that problem when it comes to hiring and staffing so we're not paying the millions in overtime going forward? Now, Moody had indicated he plans to get right to work today. His first commissioner's court meeting, though, will be next week on Tuesday. We'll have even more turnover in commissioner's court on January 1st when Judge Peter Sakai takes over as Bear County judge, replacing Nelson Wolf on commissioner's court, who has been at the head of county government for more than two decades. So we're going to see a definite sea change in what things look like. Live at commissioner's court, I'm Garrett Berger, KSAT 12 News. Keep up to date with all of San Antonio's top news, weather, and so much more by clicking the like and subscribe buttons below. And once again, thanks for watching KSAT.